So let's start from the beginning. I start with Skype and uh, by adding this uh, little USB connector to connect to my uh, headset. That's how it starts. That's the basic way how to connect a VOIP device, a software to hardware. Okay, then I got stuff like uh, this QPE, Bluetooth, uh, USB, uh, wireless, actually a piece of funny gadget, 5 meter in range of your PC you'll get uh, your USB signal. Then you got the standard, uh, let's call it uh, USB cable phone, I would recommend using this anymore. Anyway, so now we got USB wireless which actually connects via USB dongle, a little bit more powerful than the QPE, to your PC. And within 10, let's say 15 meters maximum, you'll have a ringing signal from Skype. And this one is a good one because it actually has a long, uh, very long battery life, very, uh, to be recommended. Very simple also, and no wires. Of course, if you want to go to the fancy stuff, you go to things like uh, this, Netgear, first version Wi-Fi uh, Skype Wi-Fi wireless phone uh, works as long as you can find an open Wi-Fi if you know the keys so don't start hacking uh, those keys there <laughs> uh, and don't put it too close to your ears because it's, it's kind of warm now then you, you have the ways to connect your, your normal telephone uh, which is this type of stuff or that one to your uh, your PC to Skype, which is this kind of thing, AU600. Phone cable goes in, phone line goes in, connect to USB, got your versions of US Robotics, got the early uh, Jabber Nut. Don't know what happened to those guys, but quite fancy, a bit eccentric, the box that is. Then you got the standard USB tail box from Mplot. USB cable in, phone line in, phone line out. And this brings us to these devices, which uh, I'm going to test now. So we are talking here about uh, the Volsky Exchange, that's the, the, the Volsky Exchange 9000. USB cables in to the PC, phone cables to the trunk of the it's cable fast again, <laughs> to the PBX. That's one element which I've been looking at. I, I forgot one. The phone is, is a USB dual phone, uh, deck phone, does uh, telecom, does USB Skype, works perfectly. That's As far as I'm concerned, this is still the, the winning model today. It's simple, it's to the point, you plug it into your PC and it's working. No hustle, uh, an idiot can use it. Okay, back to the boxes. This is the Wisecom Tech. One USB channel, not four like in the case of the Vosky one USB channel always I always wonder how they are possible to tunnel all the sound there you can actually connect four direct phone lines to this one or four PBX uh, trunk lines CO1 till CO4 uh, that's good it's kind of not so expensive good to for small company and then you got the Zipcom which is a bit more big oh, so as you can see difficult to handle it's a big chunk it's more sturdy I would recommend this for take companies that have a bit more heavier usage it's a metal box it's a bit more solid but still only one USB port and this one you can connect FXS ports to the trunk of the PBX so Vosky Wisecom Tech Zipcom let's try now to continue with the Vosky over and out